One of the Oregon victims grew up here in Southern California. CBS 2's Adriana Weingold spoke to that victim's friend for reaction to today's events. As the president visited Roseburg, former classmates of Kim Saltmarsh Dietz, a 59 year old woman who was shot and killed in last week's massacre, are remembering their dear friend. She even said that when she was going to come down for the reunion, would I save her a dance? So I was, said yes, of course. And then, then I heard about the news. McDougall went to Mission Viejo High School with Dietz and says, like him, she was a Second Amendment supporter. A mechanical device cannot do anything without someone operating it. A car can't kill a person without someone driving it. A gun can't kill somebody without pulling the trigger. Anybody want another side? In Roseburg, some are protesting the president's visit, saying he's only there to politicize his own anti gun agenda. If I lived in Oregon, uh, I might not feel very well if the president were coming to speak about his opinions regarding gun control or whatever because he would be using that event to espouse his political beliefs. But the White House insists the trip was about consoling the families so deeply affected by this tragedy. But back at home where Deeds grew up, McDougal and other classmates are getting ready for homecoming, taking time to look back on a life taken away too soon. Friends and former classmates say they plan to honor Kim with a moment of silence at tomorrow's alumni picnic. Reporting in Mission Viejo, Adriana Weingold, CBS 2 News.